Sean, you screwed up well. Off on a date? Yeah. I'll pick your little princess up after school. Nice right, fun. Got a spoiler rotten. I bet you that. Where is uh, oh, that new organic burger bar down South Road? Organic? Where did that open? It comes to mint. Yeah. Got you there, Tony lad. Wouldn't soil her palate. Nice chicken nuggets, milkshake and a movie. Hey, how'd you get on before? All right, all right. What? Like plugging the hoover? I need to talk to you without sex. Mrs. Give me the evils, okay? Addie's not here, and don't be nasty about we best meet. You've never liked her. Friends like her who needs enemies. You're funny. I need to talk about us, not here. Tony. I don't want to be 70. I feel like I've wasted my life. I thought it was because of your sister. It's everything, but at the end of the day, Tony, it's you. Go to where? Big dish for me. I gamble, womanize, and drink too much, do drugs. I crap around the house, but I could improve. I take more interest in the kids and you. Tony, I'm sorry. But I just don't like you anymore. How oh, much is that? I can't think of any other way of letting you know how strongly I feel. Well, couldn't you try to make me for the sake of Josh and that? <laughs> what do you think I've been doing the past couple of years? Sit and smile, let things wash over me, have a glass of wine, try and forget about the sinking feeling the minute your door key goes in the lock. Thanks a lot. When was the last time you wrote for me back? I didn't know what needed room. Told me I look nice. I say that all the time. You don't? I think. You don't show me any affection whatsoever. I came here to wear a thing out. And I look at you. And I want to put my arms around you. Only now you do. I 
actually the moon? No. No, it's not. Okay. So, what about the other kids? No way. They're all my mates. Where is she? I'm cutting. I don't want to be with somebody who says she doesn't even like me. How do you think that feels, eh? How can you say that to me after having two kids with me? A build must this old. I want you to just go. Now. Well, let's get this straight. You're stopping me seeing our kids. Until you can learn how to be a proper father, I am. How can I do that if I can't even see them? I told you, you can't be trusted to look after them. You've never learned how to look after anybody but yourself. I've got one option here. I'm one option only, and it's the last thing I wanted to do. Exactly. Well, it's going to cost a fortune because you're too stubborn and want to fight me all the way. Fight. Your word, not mine. Okay, Tony, this is a classic case. I get them all the time. It's happened to make me feel better. Well, all I'm trying to say is that you're not alone. You see, women have discovered that we, men, are not needed anymore. Of course we are. Well, they can't have kids by themselves, can they? <laughs> nope. Okay, okay, there's the not so worthy mate, there's the turkey baster and the gay mate. But generally, the ones that want to go it alone have found the bloke. You. Clubs are nice and thought of Brad Pitt, George Clooney, Wayne Rooney. Oh, hang on, how did they get in here? <laughs> Nine months later, she's dropping one. Mission accomplished. Then the reality of the day-to-day -day kicks in. They want to move on. Without the mobile sperm donor sitting in front of the plasma, clogging up the living room with his sweaty feet and overflowing ashtrays and beer, though. Don't smell it. Okay. So have you tried talking? Yes. Got nowhere? That's right. You want to see your kids? Absolutely. How often? As much as I can. Do you mean shared access? Go on. 50-50. Half a week with the mother, the other half with you. That's fair, isn't it? Right. I'll contact her and see how she meets that not so unreasonable request. I knew you'd end up here. I didn't want it to seem like it was a done deal. I went to school to pick my daughter up and she was <coughs> out. Teacher said she was sick, so I goes round to the ex's flat. She's out. Neighbour says she took off to a festival. Which one? Does it matter which one? Trans, techno, tribal fusion? Okay? Sorry mate, I just wasn't. Do you want to go for a beer after you've seen the brief? Who is your father trying to meet you? You come with us if you want. Nah, I'm not so sure, mate. Why is that? Well, I've never been one for joining things. You joined the army, didn't you? Well, I didn't have any job prospects. It's not job prospects. You made in other people's countries. I learned to trade. How to drive a tank. Come and useful, does it? All right, then. Lead the way. Dress up like superheroes and scale tall buildings. Some of these fellas have been going to. We got doctors, teachers, journalists, dentists, and social workers, IT guys, medical reps, estate agents, PR gurus, and your generic white collar workers. A lot. They've all got one thing in common. Separated from their kids. Yeah, every one of them. Some get angry. Some just keep it together. Don't look the ball. Some get depressed, well, in fact, a lot get depressed. But we come here and we share information, we try and change the law. I could tell you stories of injustice that make the hair on the back of your neck curl. My young still is doing that right now, to be honest. You see that fellow there reading The Guardian? His wife met somebody else. Turned him out. Homeless. Ended up in an hostel. Can't see your kids from one of them places, can you? He used to work in a bank, and now he can hardly hold a pen. Nelson Mandela, 
Gandhi, they all stood up for their rights, didn't they? Well, not Gandhi, you're always sitting down, but you see where I'm coming from. Who's in? Come in, I'll make you a cup of tea. When did you learn how to do that, smart Alex? I'm not arguing with you. Just as well. We're not fitting anywhere. We'll drop the 50-50. No. You know I'll take this to court. It shouldn't have to come to that. Well, it will we'll if you don't. This out between us. How can we if you won't see it from where I'm standing? Well, why don't you see it from... Oh, you're no use. Yeah, and you are when you're like this. I'll do anything to stop you having them half the week. It'll cost a fortune. I don't care what it costs. Well, neither do I. Right. Claire. I don't want to fight you. We'll drop the 50-50 then, or you'll have the mother of all fights. 